Hey guys, Chris with Nichols Retirement Empire. Um, you guys may, may be asking, well, why, Chris, why are you sweating? Well, what, you're supposed to be retired. You're supposed to be relaxing. Well, I'm down here in Florida and we are uh, cleaning up the boat today. So, um, take a look. I want you to look and see what the inside of the boat looks like uh, so you can get an idea because after you've been fishing for about two or three days, uh, it can get pretty nasty. If you guys have been watching me, you know we have a new boat, so it should clean up pretty easily. Now, in the past, I have used uh, bleach and things like that to clean my boat, but I've always had a used boat. And you, everybody knows that bleach will eventually damage your boat. If you use cheap cleaners, eventually it's going to take off the gel coat. So this is a brand new boat. I don't want to damage the gel coat. Now, luckily, I had a uh, guy named Jonathan call me up from Better Boat and he wants me to try out their cleaner. Uh, I'm gonna try out their deck cleaner today. And I'm going to try out their instant hull cleaner today. And if necessary, I'm going to try out their boat erasers. All right, this is, a, this is an American company um, I like to try to buy things that are made in the United States or companies that are based in the United States. Uh, they cost, uh, I want to say both of these cost $17.99 uh, for both these products and then I'll have a discount code that I believe is 15% off that we'll put at the end of the video. Okay, alright, so the first thing I'm going to do is spray the boat down. Um, alright, I got everything sprayed down. and. I have put some of the instant hull cleaner in this spray bottle, so I'm going to go around, I'm going to spray the hull all the way around. It's supposed to be strong. This is supposed to be something that you're not supposed to have to scrub or anything like that. You're supposed to be able to just spray it down, let it set for two minutes. And you can tell, like, you know, everything's beating up on this boat, you know, because it's a brand new boat. All right, what I have determined is with my older boats, you know, I'd get them and there were already stains on them and stuff like that. Uh, this boat doesn't have any stains, and I want to keep it like this. I want the gel coat to stay good. I want it to keep looking good. So I can't use those cheaper products like I have in the past. I need something that's going to keep this boat looking the way I want it. All right, and I'm going to spray these surfaces up here too. Now I'm sure they make a uh, <clears throat> they make a seat cleaner and stuff like that. So, uh, but that's what gets damaged the most when you use a cheaper cleaner like bleach or something that's too harsh and not formulated for a boat. It's been a couple of minutes, so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to spray it down. trying to make sure I go in the order of how I put it on so it's had two minutes to work. Now there's always going to be some places in here that you're going to have to go back over. That's why they've got that eraser. And the side looks nice and clean. So as far as the hole cleaner, um, that looks like that did a good job. I haven't really scrubbed anything. I've just put it on, sprayed it on, and washed it off. Alright, now the deck cleaner, let's see how that works. All right, deck cleaner. It's supposed to wet the deck, which we have. Uh, apply a solution to the area to be treated and spread evenly with the deck brush and allow it to sit for two to three minutes and then scrub with the deck brush. Rinse thoroughly when clean. Okay, that's your typical directions for a deck cleaner. So, let's see how this works. Okay, I'm just gonna kind of pour it around in here. 
And I'm going to come back with my deck brush. All right, we have applied it to the whole surface. Now let's wait a couple of minutes. All right, uh, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna scrub it one more time. It's been a couple of minutes. Then I'm gonna hose it down again and see what we got. It looks good right now. All right, now I'm gonna go back and spray. back, wash all this down in here, like if you look right here, there's a speck right there, and that takes that off, uh, let's see, looks like there, or a couple of places. There's always some places right in here around your around your rail. All right, like there's a scuff mark underneath this rail. Okay, so now your spots on your uh, on your dash, on the seat, stuff like that. This thing does really good for that. I'm really pleased with that. All right, so overall, it does what it's advertised to do. Um, everything looks good and clean. Uh, I am going to go back. I'm going to do the floor again because this is a, uh, you know, I probably won't come fishing for another, you know, month, probably a few weeks. So I want to make sure I get it really good and clean. I'll do another application on the floor with that deck cleaner, um, but it looks good and white. The sides look really good. Uh, like I said, I just want to make sure I have a cleaner that's going to protect my gel coat. It's going to take care of my new boat and uh, not something that's going to damage it like bleach. Now, you can throw bleach in the bottom of any boat, take it out there, set it in the sun, and it's going to turn white. It's going to look good. But you do that for six, seven years, you're going to end up with chips in your floor. Uh, the upholstery is going to get dry, and, you know, it, there's enough damage from the sun from this stuff anyway. So you don't want to add to it by those chemicals. So I like it. Uh, it's a good product. I'll put a link to it um, on the video where you can get a 15% off, and uh, I believe both those bottles, like I said, were $17.99. I want to say these sponges were about seven bucks. So, thanks for watching, Nichols Retirement Empire. Okay, guys, this is the after shot. I told you when it dries out a little bit, and every one of these things has some kind of little whitening agent, whether it's bleach or whatever in it, uh, but you can see it is pure white. It looks fantastic. Uh, I probably could have gotten by without the two applications of the deck cleaner, but, you know, I wanted to go ahead and do that, and it looks fantastic. So, there you go.